Hey everyone, welcome back to Open Country. Today we're going to pick up right where we left off. Hopefully there will be a call on the walkie-talkie here soon. <clears throat> Excuse me. Breaker 1-9, do you copy? This is an emergency. Over. Breaker 1-9, do you copy? This is an emergency. Over. Copy, Gary. Talk to me. Over. I'll keep this short. The hub regulars are very concerned that one of them, Jerry Barlow, has gone missing. He left about three days ago, and he should have been back yesterday morning, but nothing so far. Okay, uh, any leads on his last whereabouts? He said something about going to Burden Caves to hunt bears. That's my best bet. Great. Well, let's hope you're right. <clears throat> Let's hope he's not there. Got it. Over and out. All right, so <clears throat> we're going to Cedar Pond in Tumnus Valley. Pretty sure I'm in Tumnus Valley, but let's check. Cedar Pond, Cedar Pond. Where are you, Cedar Pond? There, Cedar Pond, right there. <clears throat> so our best parking spot is probably going to be... Hmm. Mountain Pass. <clears throat> Neither of them are close. Uh, let's go. Let's go South RV. Thinking that's the least chance of running into bears and wolves. the northwest shoot so much for that <clears throat> let's go ahead and switch back to our shotgun I should have picked up those leaves. Because you know at some point I'm going to need to make a campfire. Anyway. 
Anyways, how's everyone doing this weekend? One week closer to end of year. Not that I'm counting. <clears throat> Got a little frog in my throat, apparently. Yeah, so we're gonna do a little, little, little running, little hunting. Since uh, Jerry was gonna go hunting bears, I'm guessing we're gonna run into a bear at some point. <clears throat> Let's take a look at the map, see where we're at. Oh shit. One wolf. Two wolves. Didn't really want to drop the meat, but <clears throat> I forgot to sell off a bunch of stuff. Um, I need to go southwest. All right, we're almost to Cedar Pond. I'm guessing this is going to be it here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <clears throat> Recover the hunter's knife. Okay. Jerry's knife. I saw it. Jerry's knife. Okay. Um... Where is it at now? Oh, there it is. Well, this can't be good. Breaker 1-9, are you there, Gary? Over. Gary here. <clears throat> Got any leads? I found
found a small camp. Near the campfire was a knife sheet with the letters JB branded on it and an improvised hatchet. The hatchet's fairly new. It doesn't look like it's been used much. Probably made recently. And a blood trail. I'll follow it. Oh, I'm worried now. Let me ask one of the locals about the knife sheet. Over and out. You mentioned blood last. The knife sheet does belong to Jerry. You're on the right track. Well, that was fast. No time to lose, bud. Let me know if you find anything else. Over and out. Grab that. Oh. Okay, so we go into Burton Cave. <clears throat> okay, yeah, and I can never remember how to get to that. There's like one little trail. Uh oh. There it is. More blood. <clears throat> that can't be good. Oh, found it right off. More blood. Hunter's Cave. Okay, that one was up higher, I think. I do is just follow the blood. Nope, not this cave. So I just need to go find the blood and follow it. There's some blood right there. How is it not that cave? Or is it over here? Yeah, there's another cave over here and I see blood already. Why do I feel like I'm going to get attacked? Uh, on second thought, I'm not going to put my gun away yet just yet. <clears throat> not there.
Did I walk past him? No. <clears throat> but I need sleep. And I cannot set my tent up in here. So we're going to quickly sleep till morning. And we need to drink. All right. Now then. What else did I pick? Oh, no. Jeez. We'll drop the stick. Now, where is... Where is the dude? Battery's about to die. is the hunter. I think I heard something. Oh. Didn't even know about this. Okay. Uh oh. That's no good. Hello? Is anybody there? Over here. I need help. Please help me. I'm wounded. I'm wounded. <coughs> Resume your Jerry Barlow. You don't look good. What happened? The most stupid thing happened. I'm almost ashamed to tell. I was camping for a bit after a fruitless bear hunt the other day. And I was set in bear traps. And this morning, woke up and I didn't look where I was placing my foot. And then, <laughs> the bear trap snapped. <clears throat> oh, you must have lost a lot of blood. Not that much. I had a first aid kit on me. I never leave hunting without. Well, that's good. Now let's get you to the ranger. Oh, I'm not going anywhere. There's at least a bear roaming around this area. They might smell the blood. If they do, I'm as good as sitting ducks. Mm, you're right. I'll go outside the cave and give Ranger a call. Great. Go directly above the cave. There's better signal there. Great, thanks. <clears throat> Alright. Get out of the mine. Get out of the mine on the other side. Um, that does not make any sense. But... I remember how how do I change my batteries? I know there was a way. <clears throat> I just don't remember how. Or is it just that? Yeah, it was just that. Okay. <clears throat> um now then we cannot I don't think we can get out that way nope oh wait maybe <clears throat> Barry was here Oh, hello, Barry. Mm. 
Oh, that light is blinding. That light, even worse. Is there a way out? At least, there it is. The heck is that? Is that a rabbit? Something's running. Oh. Oh, we're way over weight again. So I guess we drop our sticks. Some meat. Wow, we're still overweight. Okay, so up here should be Burton's hole. I went the wrong way. I'm an idiot. <clears throat> Don't be like me. Oh, mail. Mail time. Okay, now we're at Burton Hole. Breaker 1-9. Ranger, I've found Jerry Barlow. Do you copy? Over. That's fantastic news. Can you bring him to me? Not on my own, Ranger. Negatory. He caught his leg in a bear trap and can barely <clears throat> walk out. I found him in one of the Burton Caves. Can you come down here? Will do. I'll be there in a few minutes. Over and out. Okay, so find a shortcut to the west and go back to the hunter. A shortcut to the west. You mean like jumping off the rocks that kind of looks like a shortcut but it also looks like death
I have an idea. Place. We're gonna save. Pack. All right. Oh wait. All right. I guess I don't have to take the uh, the death road. I knew that was going to happen. Alright. Where is that cave again? Nope. Hello, skunk. Let me get my gun out. Because I have a feeling I'm going to get that bear. Oh, there it is, right there! Notify the hunter that Ainsley is willing to help. Oh, here's the blood. Okay. Now that secret passageway was right here. Okay, well, where the heck did he go? Who's not up here? Oh, there he is. Well, this is a surprise. Hey, no surprise here. I may walk as slow as a snail, but when bears are around, I sure can climb faster than a squirrel climbs trees. That's great, but let's see how we'll climb you down from there. Who says he's gonna climb down? Ranger Ainsley, you got rope? Yeah, we're going to hoist him up. Here, tie this rope around it. There's an exit over there. You can get out from there and come back up to us. We're going to take him to the water tower cabin. Looks like there's a mailbag. Well, that was one big pickle we avoided. Yeah, it's all <clears throat> my fault I've gotten you into this. I knew this whole hunt was a bad idea. That bear was almost the end of you. And I could never forgive myself for that. There's no need for all this self-blame. It could have happened to anyone. Heck, I've done worse mistakes when I should have known better. Ranger Ainsley is right. It's all behind us. You're safe, and you're going to get medical attention for those wounds of yours. It could have been a whole lot worse for you. You're lucky that we were around and could help you. Oh, I have no idea how to repay you. I owe my life to you two. You don't owe us anything, Jerry. Yeah, just be careful in the future. But I can't just be indifferent of what you did for me. Oh, I know. How about this? If I ever run into someone that has a hunting gig, I'll recommend you. What do you say? Hmm, that could be useful. If you say so, Ranger. And here, this is for you. It's the least I can do for you. A token of my gratitude. I appreciate it, Jerry. Come on, you need medical attention urgently. Keep in touch. Keep in touch. All right. 450 bucks. Okay. Well, let's uh, figure out where we are. We're going to go 
directly east. We're going to head back to the lodge. Well, actually, first of all, we can go ahead and Oh, I don't have any to use. Okay. Anyways, let's go to the lodge and let's trade in some of the stuff that we've got. So that way we're not constantly overweight. <clears throat> we'll let the fox survive. I hear a wolf. There. Oh shit. We're just gonna deal with it. We're almost to the RV anyways. I'm not about to drop any valuable pet pelts. Um, directly east. Oh, there he goes. Some shotgun ammo for sure, though.
Come on, these controls are so sensitive. Okay, there's the RV. At least let me walk a little faster. To the lodge we go. Uh, see where our next mission is going to be. It's going to be Gary. Hello. All right, Nancy. Hey. I need you to buy some stuff from me. to the camper. Because... I want to put some stuff in the trunk here. Uh, we're going to take... Actually, let's move that. That. That, that, um, ooh, you know what I need to do? I need to get some water. I need to get some water. Take one of the ATVs? What the heck? I don't want a racing billboard. I want an ATV. All right, well, you know what? Since they're not going to give me an ATV, um, I think I'll just go it. Bleh. Try that again. I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, call it here. I'm not going to make you guys watch me make this long run to go fill my water bottles. Um, but anyways, if you uh, liked the video, if you could please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet subscribed, please do subscribe. But otherwise, um, yeah, I think I will see you guys next time.